Bum, bidi, bum, bum, bum. Bum, bidi, bum, bum, bum. Where are you all? Speak to me, people. Speak to me. Right, we're just waiting to go live. And then we can get talking. Yes. Hello. I've got two people here. Hello, two people. Don't know who you are, but hello. Welcome. Uh, I've got 12 now. I'm waiting on the comments to come through, but they're not showing just yet. But hello, welcome, 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 everybody that's here. It's good to see you. Hello, Divine Anne. Hello, hello, hello. Good to see ya, good to see ya. Hey, hey, I'm just doing this pinned post. Hold on, my little kiddies. Um, one second, that's why I can't see comments. Five, seven, eight, zero, zero. That should work. Right, let's see what's going on. Who's all here? What is all saying? What is all saying to it? God, sorry, folks. I'm making you all fall over the place. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, Caroline. Hello, Vicky. Um, hello, Mark. Hey, good to see you. Um, Robert C. Stern, good to see you as well. Kathy Hall, good to see you. I don't know if any of you could see me. It's very dark in this living room tonight. But I'm not putting the light on because it means I would need to get up off my backside. And, well, I just can't be bothered getting up off my backside, to be honest with you. So, <laughs> we're just going to put up with it like this. Yes, that's all I could say. Not matter. Hope yous are all well. Hope yous are all well. Hello, Jude Davidson. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, Natasha Hens. Hello, la. Who else have we got? Sandra Lunt, hello. So our little two that we had just 30 seconds ago has jumped its wee backside up to 63 yet already. Wow! Good to see us. Elaine Williamson, are you watching Comic Relief? Well, it's on. But I'm not really watching it. I, I didn't mean to sound awful or anything, but I just didn't like these sort of programmes. They're a bit... <sighs> It's like watching the news. It's a bit depressing, isn't it? It really is. Um, so, yeah, I'm not really watching. I'm going to pop a light on, folks, because I've just realised it is slightly very much dark. So let's let's do that. There we go. That's better. Sorry about the mess of me. I'm just sitting slouched on the sofa, you know, with my PJs on. Slouching. Uh, minding my own business. So there we go. Um, Elaine is saying it looks looking cosy. It was, eh? Maybe I should put the light back off again. No, it just looks a bit too bright. <laughs> but never mind, never mind. Chelsea, just here for the madness. Well, you came to the right blinking place. Um, definitely to the right place is what all I can say. Um, it is the it is the live of madness. You're here. You're live with psychic spratty the nutty. The nut job psychic, which is I find it quite amusing that I'm the nut job psychic. Um Dotty uh Welsh is saying, Hi John, I move. Thank you. Oh no, will I move? Dotty, um straight away as I read your question there. Yes, definitely move coming forward for you. Coming in quite soon as well. So be paying attention as we're moving forward to you. Pay particular attention to the end of next month. The end of next month's feeling nice for me. Um, so just watch about round then for you. Some nice interesting news coming forward. Linda Kilburn, hello, how are you? Good to see you. Um do, 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 do. So yeah, we're just gonna do a wee live. I just thought it would be really, really good. Look at Divine Anne sending all these cute little emojis. It's a little hacker emoji from the emoji film. Ha ha ha! The ah, cool, cool, cool. Lisa Jack, hello, good to see you as well. Um, yeah, good to see loads of you folks. Good, good, good. Make sure you're hitting up your share button. Um, and we'll do some free readings right here in just a few minutes. Don Spear Sunderland lost my top fan status. Don't know why. <gasps> that is not good. Do you know? I don't have any control over these little badges that Facebook do. Um, they give you them, they take them away, they take them back, they give them back, they do whatever with them. But I do know you've got to comment loads and loads and loads to get them. Um, apart from that, I know nothing. I know nothing. I know nothing. Um, 
Facebook is in total control of those. So there you go. Um, do, 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 do. Do, what else have we got going on here? Gary, Gary, good to see you. Gary, Gary. Surely that's not your proper name, Gary, Gary. That's like me being called John, John. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> but there we go. Esther Phillips, I can't hear you. Well, I'm really sorry, Esther. I didn't know any sign language to tell you how to turn your volume up. Um, turn your volume up at this side. Don't know if that helped you any, love, but hopefully you'll be able to hear me now. Uh, <laughs> can everybody else hear me? I'm sure everybody else can. Um, if somebody could type turn your volume up to who can't hear me, that would be handy. <laughs> <laughs> Deary me. Um, Jen's a cosy, very sad day here in NZ New Zealand. It is, it is sending our love that way. Um, Pamela Cunningham has got a load of wee Scottish flags and four little smoochy kisses. Good to see you. Good to see you. Um, Helen Laurie, I'm still missing my son. Helen, I'm sure your son's watching over you, um, most definitely. And if he comes forward this evening whilst I'm live, I will bring him forward to you, sweetheart, okay? But 100% sure that he's standing by your side, giving you that energy. Jodie Brown, who's pronounces her name Brownie, but her name's actually just Brown because we discovered this this afternoon, is saying, What you say? I don't know. Why you say? Why you say, 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 why you say? Um, Gary, Gary is called Gary Skelly. It is John John. Lol. <laughs> good to meet you, good to meet you. Um, Deborah Stark does book up for Spooky Hunt in Paisley. Where's that just gone? Where's it gone? Ah! Booked up Spooky Hunt in Paisley, John. Looking forward to it, Deborah. I'm looking forward to seeing you in Paisley at the sanatorium. How did I know that? I have got no idea. It just came on the top of my mind and I was like, sanatorium, Paisley. Boom, boom, boom. Yes. I hope loads of you are coming on ghost hunts for me because there's loads going on. Um, Jenza is saying, how was your son's birthday? Absolutely chaos from morning till night. Um, that's probably the best thing, best way to describe that, really. Yeah, <laughs> chaos, madness. So let's do some um, Ridanos. Yes, some Ridanos. For anybody that's new and doesn't know what a Ridano is, didn't he ask me because it's a word that I've just made up. Okay, we're going to do some readings um, while smelly errands in the shower. I thought I would come here and keep all you guys and girls company. So, get your questions coming in, what you want me to have a look at. We'll do spirit messages and we'll just do blooming everything. Whatever you ask, if I'm drawn to your name, I'm drawn to your question, I will come in and I'll see what is going on. Caroline Wallace, still got my top fan plus one, thank the Lord. I don't even know what the plus one is. I think that means you're a top contributor. You're a contributor. Or a valued commenter even, because I've just seen somebody there with valued commenter badge. So that's what you are. You're a valued commenter and a top-notch fan. Well done, top-notch fan. <laughs> so get those questions coming in to me folks and as I say if I'm drawn to you I will come to you and I will do my very very best Claire McDonald is scared of the Ouija board nothing to be scared of nothing to be scared of with a Ouija board um, if they're done correctly done with somebody that could hear, see, feel does something for spirit it's all good it all works um, to me they're quite boring they're a bit slow but when they do get moving, you, they're great. Especially when you can get spirit to like throw the glass and stuff off the walls. And oh yeah, it gets all excited. Um, so there we go. That's what happens there. Um, Natalie Breakwell, I've just been drawn into your name. Where's your comment gone? Hope me nan pops in, please. Nan or mum, come through. My nan passed last week. Oh, sorry to hear that, sweetheart. I was drawn right into your name there. Um, I don't know why, but I was just pulled right into you. I do feel where 
I've got this lady coming forward. Now, I know you're saying that your nan passed just... You must have been really, really close to your nan, okay? Because this lady that's coming in is pulling herself right in by my side. It's like she's got that mum vibration as well here, okay? A real strong woman. A what you see is what you get type of lady. No holding back. I really do feel this really peaceful passing with her because I want to rub my hands together. So she was here one minute and she just slipped nicely into the spirit world there, okay? I feel someone with this lovely cheesy but cheeky sort of smile to her face as well because she's just standing here smiling at me a busy lady and someone that if you told to sit down she would stand up and she would keep moving even more okay it's I've, it's like she's got this stubborn energy that she wants to do everything her way and only her way. I feel where I need to connect myself with the month of, I want to say to you November, so November must mean something with this lady as well, your gran who's very close, because she's just given me that November month here, so her birthday are passing, something special happened to her, but that November month must also connect with her in some way, shape or form here. I feel as she's coming in by your side, sweetheart, I feel she's giving you strength, and that's what she would have done when she was here. She would have gave her strength, she would have gave those words what she needed, she gave to you okay she's the type of person that would sit for ages and just chat because she's just making me aware of chit 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 chat 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 and this is what she likes to do she likes to calm people she likes to chat to people as much as she can here i feel really nice soft skin with her and she's she's really nicely dressed as she comes in here i feel everything's matching she's telling me she's able to dance again so i feel where she's able to move she's able to walk around she could do what she wanted to do so i know that she must have been very restricted when she was here on the material plane okay she's got lovely dark colored eyes here because i'm starting to see her dark colored eyes coming forward sweetheart now you i feel you must have like a like a brooch or a pin or something because she's making me aware of her brooch being here like a badge pin brooch that's what you call them is it brooches um she's making me aware of this being here and i feel i want to connect it with you if you don't have then watch for this coming forward to you but she's making me aware of this okay please do take the love know they're in and around you and i'll say thank you very much take care for now Mwah. bless you right let's have another wee look karen amanda hello nice wee picture of a I think it's an angry bird, a chicken or something, but it's saying hi, so hi. Um, <laughs> there we go. Um, do, 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 do. Kathy Cook is my baby girl, okay? Most definitely, you know, just everybody asks this question, will they be okay when they go to spirit? Yes, your loved ones that have gone before them will be looking after them. They'll be fine. Still, as I'm as I'm even talking to you, I can just feel this little child energy in and around you. You must be aware of pulling coming in on the back of your the back of your sort of trousers or your jumper, because I could feel the tugging happen there. If you're not aware of that, watch of it over the next one to two days, because I just feel you're going to be getting a sign to say hello. We're here. We're we're by your side. Okay. Um, I do feel there is a lovely lady in the spirit world as well. I do feel she would have passed with cancer. I want to pop her on mum's side of the family suite and I just feel this is who's coming in this is who's looking after the child as well here okay take the love Mwah. bless you uh do, 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 do. what's that um do, oh, right okay <laughs> yes hello <laughs> I was seeing what it was it was big capital letters Mr Spratt I was like oh what's this it looks very official but it's somebody saying hello hello Mr Spratt <laughs> so hello they need to be official here. So, folks, make sure you're hitting your share button. You're here, you're live with John Spread, Psychic Medium. I haven't sent out a messenger alert like I would normally do if I was going live. Um, I think the app would have sent those a message, um, but I'm not 100% sure. But please do stick with me, hit your share buttons, and we'll see what is going on. I'm just doing random readings, having a look, seeing what is going on. And I'll bring through a wee couple of messages for you while Smelly Erin's in the shower. For anybody that doesn't know who Smelly Erin is, she's the missus. She's the wife. She's having a shower. All right. So let's do another couple and see where we are going. And whilst I'm just looking at my comments, looking at the screen, folks, remember, check out my website. Get yourself booked in on some tickets to come and see me live on some ghost hunts as well. Uh, we've got the Prisoner of War camp, we've got a sanatorium, we've got an old jail. It's all going down. So make sure you check it out. All right. 
Right, let's have a wee look and see who we are going to next. Laura Cook, Laura Cook. Will I pass my test again, John? Let's have a wee look and see. Straight away as I'm pulling into you, I want to hand I want to hand you a medal here. So I do feel that this is going to be a yes. Definitely pass coming forward. Do you know I feel this nervousness with you? It's like I mean I know everybody gets nervous when it comes to like an exam, a test, or doing anything, okay? But I just feel like you over over sort of think it. Okay, and I feel I want to bring this calmness in. I want to settle you down. I want to say, don't be overthinking things. You already know what you need to do. It's like it's in your mind, all right? You know it all, but you sort of trip yourself up because you're too busy overthinking, over pushing it here, okay? I do feel a nice calm road coming in there for you, and I do feel the past coming in. Take the love, sweetheart. Mwah! Take the love. Um, right, where are we going next? Uh, John, I can't do the ghost hunt because the Ouija board is freaky. You don't have to take part in a Ouija board when you're on a ghost hunt. Um, you don't even have to be in the same room. We could put you doing something else somewhere else. So, Denny, panic. Denny, panic. Ouija board's fine. Ouija board's fine. Um, right, let's go to... Ryan Crossford, Ryan Crossford. Hey, John, anything from Spirit for me? Puh. I take it you mean please. <laughs> Let's have a wee look for you, Ryan. Let's connect. Ryan, straight away as I'm connecting at your vibration here, I'm aware of a gentleman stepping forward. I do feel as I'm connecting it, I want to say this is an uncle vibration. I want to say he enjoyed a good drink every now and then as well because I'm aware of having a wee drink as he's connecting into me. He's about six foot as he's coming in, so he's quite a tall gentleman, very, very slim though. But I didn't feel he was always slim. I feel he would have been quite a, you know, I didn't want to say he was Mr. Muscles or anything, but he was quite a chunky chap, okay? But he he would have lost a lot of weight there uh, with this with this gentleman. I feel blue eyes with your uncle as he's coming in here. And I do want to put him on dad's side of the family, all right? So he would be like mum's brother, all right? Um, as he's coming in, I want to connect the month of April with him. So April would be significant, either his birthday or his passing, Ryan. But April is very, very significant to him as he's coming in here. Oh, oh goody mighty. She goes, oh. I feel, oh, don't worry about me, folks. I'm just getting stabbed. Um, I actually feel there would have been a knife wound with this gentleman, okay? And it's like just in his ribcage here below the left side, okay? It's like here, like there, right there, okay? I'm aware of a wound coming right in there with this gentleman, and it feels like a knife, all right? Um, I feel he would have been a real good, funny sort of gentleman, a very hands on gentleman. Oh, God almighty, that's really sad. Oh. Um, but he would have worked with his hands, okay, and it would have been outdoor, definitely outdoors. Right, son, you need to go away, you're hurting us too much. Please do take the love, Ryan, know that he's in and around you, and I just feel he's giving you that that laughter, okay? I feel you're needing a bit of laughter at the minute, because everything's been a wee bit of doom and gloom in and around your vibration here. There's changes regarding a work situation coming in for you also. So please do take the love, and I'll say thank you very much. Mwah! Take care for now. And I know I just blew a big kiss to a chap, but I didn't care. It's like a brother love, guy love. I've put, I've put my Ireland number in wrong. Have I? Oh, so I have. Folks, if you're texting me and you're in Ireland, make sure you're not texting that number. Um... Because that's the wrong number. Let me just fix that pinned post for you. I think Erin could do it, but hold on. It's 57080, is it? Is it? 57080. Yeah. That's the right number, eh? Imagine that, folks. Eh? That's what Jaff John gets for um, trying to be a wee smart bollocks and make things work a bit better for you. <laughs> End up making his all text the wrong number. Um, I think so. Have I, is it fixed? Is it changed? Is it gone? Is it the right number now? I think so. Yeah, yeah. 57080. Oh, I'll be in the post, in the title. I don't know if you could... Erin's going to change that and fix it. Don't know if I could change it whilst I'm live, but we'll give it a good bash. Um, there we go. Thank you to Mr. Ash Flay for um, alerting my little Erin to that little technical difficulty. 
57080. Yeah, is it? You better go and check. Who knows my Ireland phone number? <laughs> who, know, who knows? No, that... It's, it's changed. It's, it's right in the post. It's right in the post? All right, okay. So it was just the pinned post on the... Po oh, God, for heaven's sakes. My God. You, they're not... Why would I need to know these things, folks? In case I want to text myself when I go to Ireland, obviously. Um, that would make sense, eh? Right. Let's do another couple. <laughs> Let's do another one. <laughs> Lost the blinking plot now. Um, right. Where are we going? Where are we going next? Hello, Kyle. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hello, Bev. Good to see you as well. Hello, Siobhan. Hello, Halls. Um, hello, Ash Flay. It's 57080. That's what I've put in my pinned post. Thanks, Ash. I'm a bit thick today. It's because Erin wasn't here. It's because Erin wasn't here to fix it. I'll let her go for a shower because she was, well, a bit smelly. Smelly, airy. Um, so I had to throw her in the, in the shower. All right. <laughs> um, Ash Flat is very, very technical, John. Yes, yes. Ash, you're very, very technical. Hello, hello. Kyle as well is here. Hello, Kyle. Um, right, let's carry on. Keep your questions coming in. We'll do another few of your wee messages. Um, where is everybody tonight? He's all blinking, sitting, watching. What is it? Red, red nose day. Red nose day. Yeah, red nose. Oh, yeah. I had a red nose on earlier on, and nobody was able to understand what I was saying because I was speaking like this because it was so tight on my nose. Um, yeah. So there we go. Right. Let's carry on, carry on, and see who we're going to go to next. Um, who we're we going to go to? Who we're we going to go to? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Um, da, 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 da. Jen's a cozy. Jen's a cozy. Um, what does Dad think about my current relationship? Thanks. Let me just connect into your questions, sweetheart, and just see what we've got coming forward for you. Do you know, straight away as I'm connecting into your current relationship, I want to say I feel really, really good with this, all right? It's got a bit of a, a real nice vibration to it. I feel this is somebody different, not somebody you would normally go with. I feel you are still, still in that early stage. We're still starting to really get to know each other and what's going on, all right? Because I'm just feeling like they're now only just starting to open up a wee bit more to you, okay? Now, as I'm connecting into you, I'm aware of a gentleman coming forward here. I do feel your dad as he's connecting into me, all right? I want to say the month of May must be significant to him. His birthday's passing or something special happened to him. About five foot nine, five foot ten in height as he comes in here. Lovely brown eyes. I feel... I feel like I can do anything with this gentleman and I feel he knows everything. It's like his head's just full of knowledge. And even when he doesn't know it, it's like he's absorbing it in, he's taking it in and he's learning as much as he can, okay? I feel a very quick passing with your dad. I'm snapping my fingers. He was here one minute, he was in the spirit world. The next minute, I really feel he's coming forward. And you know something? He's so proud of you as he comes in here. He's not a gentleman who would be saying, I love you, this, that, the next thing. He kind of kept his feelings and emotions to himself. But as he comes forward to your sweetheart, he is making me aware that he is very, very proud of you. You've put your foot down, you're pushing yourself forward and this is what he's happy for. Sweetheart, I want to draw myself to your living room. Now, I don't know if you're just about to decorate it or you're wanting to decorate it, but there is something not right in the living room and I feel your dad's coming in. It's like he's getting his paintbrush out, his rollers out and he wants to really, really get in there and help as much as he can, okay? Please do take the love, go with this relationship because it's definitely taking those nice steps forward, okay? Okay, um, enjoy it and I'll say thank you very much. Take care for now. Mwah. Bless your cotton wee sockies. Um, right, let's see. Let's see where we're going to. So folks, keep your little shares and your wee love hearts and your wee thumbs and your wee everythings all going around and about. Um, that would be lovely. Hey, John, can I book an appointment with you? Yes, you can do that on my website, uh, johnspratt.co.uk. Go to the About John page, the About page. You'll see a wee orange button on there, schedule an appointment with John. Just click on there and you can book a date and a time to suit you. And it doesn't matter where you are in the world, it could be done through, hello, you were on the phone, or 
like face to no face to face but like video to video okay and for those very very shy people i also do messenger readings where we can just type to each other um but yep you can book that on there do not worry um what else have we got going on there hi john had a reading tonight with james on your line amazing Glad you enjoyed it. Glad you enjoyed it, Helen. Um, they're there. They're amazing. They're there 24 hours a day. Well, the change around as the night and the day goes on. Um, but they are there. Um, and I'm glad you enjoyed your reading with... Who did you say? James. Yeah, James. Um, glad you enjoyed your reading there. All right. Take care. Right. Where am I going to now? Where am I going to now? Hi, jo Hi. <laughs> Every time I go to a reading, I get subtracted by somebody else's messages. <coughs> Scott Monk, good evening. You're giving me a load of um British flags. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Give you a wee salute there. Hope you're good. Um, where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Um, De Denise Argan. Argan, yeah, Denise Argan. Denise Argan is saying, Hey, John, do you see love? <gasps> oh, let's have a wee look, Denise, and see if we could say love for you. Denise, straight away as I'm pulling into your vibration, I feel you're no long out of a relationship, okay? It's like something, I, when I'm saying no that long, I want to say about eight to ten weeks, okay, where I feel a relationship ended and it would have been a long-term relationship, all right? Now, I, I kind of want to say to you, I don't feel anything coming in. All right, not straight away. Um, I do feel there will be a relationship coming in for you. You're not going to be, you know, on your own singing and having loads of cats. Um, I do feel there will be another relationship stepping forward to you. But I'm wanting to say to you, you need to wait. Okay, this to me feels like it's coming in more round about the November time. All right, so watch round about November. I feel between now and then, it's definitely all about you, and it's about picking yourself back up, getting your energy moving, getting yeah, getting that pride back. Okay, because I feel you've sort of lost that. All right, so that's going to be coming back into you once that comes in. As I say later on. In the year something definitely coming forward for you watch out for the initial p the start of the first name or the surname but the p initial stepping forward lovely lovely gentleman coming in um i feel that he would work to me i feel he works in like the hospital i didn't want to say he's a doctor or anything but you know maybe like a porter that sort of vibration um but i definitely see him with patience and he's moving things and he's he's in and around a hospital vibration that's the feeling i get with him okay watch for this stepping in it's definitely someone new all right take the love and i'll say thank you very much take care for now right oh dear i've got three cats i've got three cats as well don't worry about it <laughs> i mean like the ones that have 63 million cats <laughs> oh god um right Folks, I'm going to finish off just here. Um, as I say, I was only jumping on while Smelly Erin was in the shower. Um, she's now out the shower. So I suppose I better go and sit on my computer so she can listen to our telly. Um, I'm going to log into the text message in, which you can see the details in the pinned post, which has the correct um, Irish number there now. So I'm going to log in there. Um, and in my instant messaging, so it doesn't matter where you are. Obviously, instant message is a lot quicker. It's even quicker than the text. And so you should come through there. It's available worldwide. Um, come and keep me company. I'll do as many readings as I can. I'll be logged in for the next oof, couple of hours at least anyway. Um, doing all your messages. The phone team are there if you need them. If you want to book readings with me, you can book them as well, as I've already said. Folks, make sure you download my app. You'll get an alert every time I go live. You'll get loads you could have your readings from there you could play scratch to win where you could win a reading every single day of the week you can check your daily monthly weekly horoscopes you can do loads so just get it done folks all right um so come on over keep me company i'm going into the text then it's been fab speaking to you all have a wonderful night you as well margaret robertson you as well don spears you as well pauline roberts you as well sam hunt Hope you all have a lovely, lovely time. Until the next time, take care of yourselves, look after each other, and be good. Don't do anything I wouldn't do, or anything I would, which doesn't really leave you as much, but never mind. Take care. Bye-bye.